Imagine this rope, okay, pretend this rope just goes on forever. Now imagine that this rope is a timeline of your existence. You just exist forever. You see this red part? This would represent your time on Earth. You've got a few short years here on Earth, and then you've got all of eternity somewhere else. And what blows me away is some of you, all you think about is this red part. It's all you think about, you're consumed with this. You go, oh man, I can't wait till here. You know, I'm gonna work hard, I'm gonna save, 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 so I can really enjoy this part right here. And you're consumed with that, and you're thinking, oh man, am I gonna get to travel? Am I gonna eat well? Am I gonna do this during this part? And I'm like, are you kidding me? What about this? What about that? What about all this stuff that's just, it's crazy to me because the Bible teaches that what I do during this little red part determines how I'm going to exist for millions and millions and millions of years forever. And, and so why would I spend this little red part trying to make myself as comfortable as possible, enjoying myself as much as I can, Paul says, look, I'm going to live my life for this mission. I'm going to spend my life, invest my life for this moment when I cross that finish line. See, I'm going to forget about all the stuff I could enjoy. And I'm not going to look around. I'm going to be like a runner just looking at that moment when I face God. Because when I face Him, then I don't get this chance over again. We get one chance at this life on earth. And it can end at any second for any of us. We've got one chance at this, and then comes eternity. See, so people look at some of my decisions and go, oh, you're so stupid because that's going to really affect this. I go, no, you're stupid because that's going to affect all of this. Man, I, I, I'm serious. I look at the way people live and I go, wow, that is so crazy. You are so crazy. You're going to do that right now, just to enjoy right now. Not even knowing if you have tomorrow and you think that's smart and that I'm dumb.